Hello, friends. I wonder if you will take just a few moments to pause with the pastor. Today, I want to bring you a devotion that I've titled, Our Friend in Jesus. In Matthew's Gospel, chapter 9, verse 35 and verse 36, we read these words. And Jesus went about all the cities and villages, teaching in their synagogues and preaching the gospel of the kingdom and healing every sickness and every disease among the people. But when he saw the multitudes, he was moved with compassion on them because they fainted and were scattered abroad as sheep having no shepherd. My friends, some of you who read these verses of Scripture know on the deepest personal level what harassed and helpless really mean. It would appear that no one cares and that you have no friend whatsoever. However, like a glass of water filled to the halfway mark, our life, beloved, is not totally empty. You see, if we look at the verses that I've read in your hearing this morning, we can see the great shepherd caring for those of us uh, who are now or will be harassed and uh, seem helpless. The Savior is caring. We're often put into situations where we feel that we have no way whatsoever out, no one to whom we can turn to, and no way to get help that we need. Praise God, the good news and the terrific news is we do have someone who cares about us. We have someone who understands our situations in life, my friend, better than, do, than we do. We have a friend in heaven who's watching over us day and night. We do indeed have a friend in the Lord Jesus Christ. Beloved, we must always remember that our pain here is only temporary. Our suffering is only a small blip on the radar screen. You see, my friend, in Jesus, we not only have a present hope for a terrific tomorrow, but we have a compassionate God who is beside us during every step of our journey here on this earth. The Bible has said that he never, ever will leave us, nor will he ever forsake. What a friend we have in Jesus. Father, today I pray that uh, the one who seems to be most harassed and feel most helpless, that God, you would touch their lives. Let them see the power of your might in the Lord Jesus. Now, Father, as we go out into your world today, help us live our lives in such a way to make a difference. For it's in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Hey, my friend, as you go out into God's world today, smile. Uh, let others see Jesus in you. For your life may be the only Bible that some will ever read. Let them see Jesus. God bless you now.